Hello, my name's Johnny. Welcome to another World War II 172 video. Uh, today we're going to look at this armored munitions carrier, the SDKFZ 252 uh, by Ace Models. If you'd like, please subscribe, uh, like, reply, and share. Uh, let's take a look here at the box. Then we'll look at the, the parts. It has a lot of parts, as you can see. A lot of small parts. See, it's covered over and it's got a trailer. It's a small half track specifically to carry munitions. There's the side of the box. I've got that model and I've done the, that one. That's neat. That's an Austrian, based on an Austrian design, I think, that uh, it's the, the, kind of the same coming as going, the way it is on there. I've got a little bit of a write-up on here about it. Yeah, it was to, to go with the Sturmgeschutz, I believe, this uh, to carry ammunition for them. Let's look at the instructions. Lots of parts. A few parts, you, they got crossed out. So early on, 41, 42. I believe they stopped using this in the, the later part of the war, war and uh, just uh, supplied the Sturmgeschutz with uh, uh, regular vehicles, not a purpose-built one like this. Instructions. So it's got a little bit of the interior in there with the seats. And look at all those little parts going on here. I have to deal with the interlocked, interleaved wheels. Take a look at those decals. See what they have there. Uh, so they do give you that if you want that. That that's early war having it with that skull and crossbones on there. And they give you the license plates. That's a neat marking that the black with the red, I think that's like a Stranger Shoots Abtalung unit. It's kind of hard to see the white ones, the regular markings. I've got some wheels, got the base of the unit right there. It opens up, but they don't have it that you can completely open up the visors like they're showing. You did, you'd have to cut that fill out. Patches, let's look at the track. At least this one isn't all bent. Sometimes you get the rubber and they're kind of twisted, but it's still going to be hard to deal with because this is just like pure rubber. So it's always tough to try to glue that and hold that. Lots of wheels. Their molding and casting is never that crisp or clean on an ACE kit. But they make a lot of things that I haven't seen in other brands. Uh, and it's all right. That's for the trailer. Let's see what we got on here. They give you a machine gun. Some of these things they say to cut off and not use, but it's nice to have that. And then some extra gas cans. I've got some tools and so forth on here. We'll look at that again on the instruction sheet on the sprue that you don't have to use all of those. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think they give you this because this must have been on the basis of this, this regular 
a smaller one and they give you stuff more with the crew you get uh, this is good because you use this on other things there's another machine gun uh, there's the infantry weapons the rifle submachine gun the Schweizer as they like to say there's a lot of those so there's some useful extra parts on here and you can see the the molding on here it isn't that crisp and then there's a lot of flash. Uh, but it'll be a good model. Let's take a look at the instruction sheet again on the sprues. And I see they're Xing out all of the, the rifle and the machine gun and some of the other things that uh, you don't specifically need for this, but uh, good parts, good parts. All right, so that's a look at the, this one. The armored munitions carrier, the 252 by Ace. Until next time, or World War II 172. Thank you for watching.